After reviewing hundreds of Shopify stores, I deem these apps as essential. In this video, I will break down seven apps that I believe every clothing store should have. But first, only 17% of you are subscribed to our channel. Subscribe now. We're trying to reach 50,000 subscribers by the end of the year. Also, don't skip this video because every app is very unique and powerful. The last one is definitely going to be a game changer for a lot of you. Coming in at number one is Sendlane. This is for email marketing, SMS, and reviews. I know what you're saying, yeah, we're Klaviyo people, but Sendlane is uh, making some waves. There are a all-in-one app for leveraging email, SMS, and reviews to boost Shopify conversions. For email marketing, Sendlane integrates with your ESP for tracking purchases back to your campaigns. This enables you to identify your highest converting emails. Powerful automation also lets you trigger behavioral campaigns like browse abandonment, cart recovery flows. Same lane also supercharges your post-purchase experience with SMS and review capabilities, all integrated within your Shopify store as well. It allows you for sending timely SMS messages, also requesting reviews and handling the reviews right within the same ecosystem. In case you didn't know, personalized SMS messages for uh, outreach for reviews actually convert about 35% better than just doing email campaign. And obviously more reviews mean higher conversions. Sendlane is definitely a competition to, to Klaviyo and I know we've in the past basically highlighted Klaviyo and for a lot of our customers we use Klaviyo but Sendlane really uh, I think in terms of pricing is also a little bit better and if you go through their landing page here uh, you'll see they, they take a few stabs at, uh, at Klaviyo especially one being like you know why pay for reviews when you can leverage them for free with Klaviyo you have to pay a little bit extra to to get reviews sort of integrated within the same ecosystem and then pricing for them even yeah right here because let's face it paying for contacts suck so uh, you only pay for what you use so when you you're selecting your plan you basically sort of craft your own plan based on how many emails you're sending how many uh, sms credits you need uh, and then it gives you an annual and, and monthly options in here so pricing may be a little bit better if you're coming from from klaviyo or if you're not using klaviyo and you want a, an option i think sendlane is going to be game changer for you um, if you're looking for maybe something a little bit more economical or pricing was just makes a little bit more sense than, than something like Klaviyo. And I think in terms of features, they're both very comparable. And like I said, I think Sandlane has more of a complete package when it comes to those three things, email marketing, SMS, and reviews all built into one. Now coming in number two, this is something that Aaron, my business partner, has probably talked about quite a lot, and that is Triple Whale. This is for analytics, attribution, and a little unknown thing, surveys, post-purchase surveys. Uh, you can actually do just a quick one post-purchase survey if you install this free Triple Whale app on your Shopify store. So understanding your customer's journey and knowing what's working is critical for growing and for conversion on your store. So Triple Whale provides those deeper analytics and attribution modeling. So you can see exactly how customers are discovering your brand and what factors influence their actual buying decision. Triple Whale analytics reveal how much revenue is driven by say direct visits, organic search, paid ads, referrals. So it breaks it down for each marketing channel. So granular attribution shows your highest converting keywords, creative, landing pages, and just a lot more. So this intelligence will enable you to optimize your marketing spend, double down on tactics that drive conversion. The great thing also, which I talked about a little bit ago, was the post-purchase survey. So you get just a simple post-purchase survey at the end on your thank you page to uncover any conversion barriers or anything like that from directly from your customers. So obviously this feedback is going to be amazing for you. If you're not doing any post-purchase surveys, I would highly recommend to do it even if you don't install triple well doing something different with with some kind of post purchase survey app to again tap into knowledge and intelligence from your customers directly from your customers you can rely on best practices and things like that but using something like triple well will just give you give you and enable all the data that you need to make decisions based off of what your customers are doing and saying. And I will say Triple Will has a lot of other features in here um, and even things that are coming soon. And they say for every person on your and your team, right, they'll, they'll have some kind of tool for them. But like I said, it's very, very powerful. Um, obviously my business partner, like I said, he's talked a little bit more about Triple Whale. I would say also the pricing uh, is probably on the higher end compared to maybe some other apps out there. And if you're just starting out, this is something that it may not make sense right away, uh, but it's going to be just game changer in terms of like just knowing and, and being able to scale your ad campaigns effectively. So Triple Whale, yeah, 
definitely highly, highly recommend it. Now in terms of analytics and conversion and all that, it's something else that we've always in the past actually have recommended is something like Hotjar, but recently we sort of switched camps to Microsoft Clarity because it's 100% free. You still get the heat maps, you get the session recordings, uh, you can implement it with Google Analytics so you can get a bigger, fuller picture uh, of your analytics. So Clarity combined with Triple Well and Shopify analytics will give you everything that you need to make decisions for your business. So understanding how customers interact with your store is going to be vital for conversion optimization. And Microsoft Clarity reveals you exactly how shoppers engage through doing heat maps or session recordings. Heat maps show you where customers are clicking, scrolling, hovering, or where they have the cursor focus on each page. This visual map exposes pages elements that attract attention versus those things that get ignored. So you can actually refine page layouts, content, direct focus towards conversion actions like add to cart buttons. Recordings take a step further by showing you the actual user session flow and their behavior. So watching real customers interact exposes usability issues and friction points that may prevent conversions. So fixing these significantly increase conversion rates. And obviously the best thing about it, did I mention it's free? So if we click here on the pricing page, it's free forever. It's open source and it gives you all the data at all times compared to Hotjar where I think the free account limits you up to 35 sessions per day. So you're getting a very small pool uh, for the free tier. Obviously you can pay for it and get, get a few more things, but Microsoft Clarity, free forever. You get all your data, everything right in one place. Hey, if you're enjoying this video, click on the like button and subscribe if you want more of these. Now coming down number four is Live Recover. This is for cart abandonment SMS campaign. So abandoned cards are a major missed revenue opportunity in e-commerce and Live Recover uses automated SMS campaigns to recover those lost sales and drive more conversion. So now when someone abandons their cart, Live Recover immediately triggers SMS. Now, the good thing about this is that it's technically not any sort of bot or automation or anything like that. In a world where just we're pushing towards AI and automation, essentially, yeah, just bots handling these chat messages. Live Recover actually uses humans. Me, human. Yeah, live people, live agents. And they say that they can recover up to 30% of abandoned carts through these personalized SMS outreach. Yeah, the, the great thing about it is that, yeah, you get that human touch. You actually have live people conversing back and forth with your customers to recover your abandoned carts through text messages. Like, it's just, it's great. So unlike bots, which, I mean, it could be a little bit cumbersome. Obviously they're getting better and better, uh, but at the end of the day, having a live person message your customers, it's going to be ideal and it's probably going to lead to increased conversions from these SMS outreach. And the great thing about it too is the pricing. So you can get the startup plan for only $9 a month. Obviously they take a percentage of what they actually recover uh, from revenue. So depending on what tier you're on, the higher the percentage or the lower the percentage, sorry, is going to be. So it goes from 20%, 10% and all the way down to 5%. And there you have all the pricing, $9.49 and $1.99 per month. Again, it's one of those things that I don't think a lot of people are using this and this is just gonna be a game changer for a lot of you. Now coming to number five is post pilot for direct mail marketing. So leveraging direct mail to complement your digital marketing can be super, super powerful. Post pilot makes it easy to execute highly targeted direct mail campaigns. And the best thing about it is that post pilot just integrates with your Shopify CRM containing your customer information, like their order history, lifetime value, et cetera. This is basically like using something like Klaviyo, but for direct mail. It just enables you to create these custom mailers tailored to just different audience segments in a timely manner. So you can actually stand out and actually feel more relevant, which will drive higher engagement and conversions compared to just generic messages or just relying solely on digital. This mix of having digital and real life physical marketing is just going to be absolutely game changer for you. You can actually trigger things to win abandoned carts, right? Or customers who maybe haven't checked you out in a while and recover those people back and get them to your store to purchase more. To me, the personalized touch of direct mail it's just going to be amazing because you can combine both physical and digital in order to make something like truly, truly remarkable. 
I don't think a lot of people truly realize how much of an impact direct mail can have. A lot of people kind of think that it's a thing of the past, but I do believe that this in combination, right? I'm not saying to do this by itself, but this in combination with your digital efforts is just going to be game changing for you. Hey, in this video, we only have seven apps, but if you're interested in getting our full list of recommended apps, then comment down below apps. It's very simple apps. Also, if you're using any of these apps, please let us know too in the comments. Um, let us know how they've been working for you. Now coming to number six is retention.io. And this is for identifying website traffic. So anonymous website traffic. So understanding who is visiting your store is critical for targeting them effectively, et cetera. So retention actually gives you something very unique because I would say, I think they have here, 98% of shoppers actually don't sign up for anything in your store. They may not purchase, they may not sign up for the pop-ups or anything like that. So how do you know who they are? That's where retention comes in. Now retention is able to capture email addresses without the customer having to actually insert that email address anywhere on your website. I know it seems kind of dubious, but it's 100% compliant. It's 100% legal. <laughs> And it's some, one of those things where, how come no one has ever done this before? And it's probably because it may be in a sort of a gray area, but again, it's still 100% legal. <laughs> you have bigger companies in here like Sasquatch and Dr. Sasquatch, True Classic, Vital Proteins, all using retention.io to capture more email addresses and be able to retarget them later. So this to me is one of those things where, Yes, I mean, if you're at a, a scale of you're bringing a lot of traffic into your store, but um, you're getting very low conversions, then something like retention.io might be very, very good for you because you may be losing a lot of money from driving all this traffic to your store and then like nothing is happening. At least with retention, you will have a way to sort of retarget those people, trying to get them back, incentivize them in some other ways um, in order to get them to convert. All right, and the last app that we have here is Shoplift. And this is conversion rate optimization to the moon, basically. Like this will give you proper A-B testing and optimizing your website for high conversions is essential to driving more sales. Shopify doesn't make it easy, right, for you to test, A-B test different things on your store. And that's where Shoplift really comes in. It really enables you to create and run A-B tests directly from your Shopify store. There's no extra code or anything required. You're using exactly what you're used to, which is the theme customizer. You can test variations on product pages, on content, on images, on flows. On... So you can actually do a lot with Shoplift and you can actually see real-time data from your customers instead of relying again into more of the best practices. The other great thing about Shoplift, it's a, it actually has a, some form of AI tool, I believe. It was a um, Lyft Assist is what it's called. Lyft Assist has already a bunch of blocks enabled for you. So let's say your theme may be lacking on, I don't know, maybe a good hero banner for mobile, for example, then Lyft Assist has some additional sections that you can actually test against your current theme um, to potentially, I don't know, have higher conversions. Mm, that sounds good. Yeah, it does. So Shoplift is one of those where I wish uh, they, they would have been here a long time ago. Obviously in the past, we used to have Google Optimize, which they've sort of deprecated that and we can no longer use it. So Shoplift has come around to do proper A-B testing for your Shopify store. Uh, the pricing is probably a little bit steeper than, than any other normal app are out there. Um, but again, I think the data that you are going to be able to get from this is invaluable. So starter plans are 149 per month, growth 299, scale 499. Again, at the recording of this video, these prices can also always change. So just keep that in mind. So if you want to continuously experiment and improve your website experience, then you need something like Shoplift so you can properly do A-B testing against different elements in your store. Now, if you like these seven apps that I talked about, then you're definitely going to like this next video. And these are more, a little bit more out there, right? Some unique apps that we found in the app store uh, that you probably should try, at least try them. So check that video next.